guy, uh, the forward up uh, on the red line. So I just jumped in and uh, you know, just tried to get a shot on net and uh, was fortunate enough to beat him far side high. A huge win for you guys tonight. Where do you rate this in your wins this season? Oh, you know, I thought, you know, it was kind of a teeter-totter game there. You know, we didn't play well at, at certain points and they came back in the game. And, you know, we battled back and, you know, we got two points and that was huge for us against uh, you know, the number one team in our division. Well, I best describe that third period of action there. It's just one goal after another after another, one bad bounce after another, one lucky bounce. Yeah, it was, um, you, know, it was you know, it was just teeter-totter. I mean, we couldn't, you know, we started sustaining pressure and then, you know, a couple bad bounces, uh, you know, a couple bad shifts and they, they're right back in the lead. So, um, you know, it's something we got to tighten up on and we'll work on in practice, but uh, it's for, it, we were lucky to get uh, two points out of here. Anyway, so everybody out there sort of picked him up, you know, and he said, it wasn't my night, but the guy said, all right, we're going to take you and then just dip, dealt with the adversity throughout. Yeah, for sure, you know, uh, gave up five goals against, you know, but... Uh, Came up with two points. That's the main thing. It's good to see that we can uh, score those goals when we need them. And uh, I think uh, against the first place team, again, we knew it wasn't going to be easy. And I think uh, it came right to the end. And uh, I think we're happy with the result. Was this a little bit like? I mean, I wasn't happy with Canada, but was it a little bit like the Buffalo game, seven six one on New Year's Day? Uh, I don't know. It kept going. Yeah, like uh, tonight was a lot of momentum swings. That's for sure. You know, it was back and forth, back and forth. You know, and. Uh, I think we did a good job not getting frustrated. We, we stuck with it, you know, and kept doing a lot of good things, and uh, we get rewarded for that. And uh, like I said, uh, it's one of those games that we don't want those too often, but it's good to see that we can win them when we can. You almost felt like a like a street hockey game out there <laughs> with all the momentum shifts. Yeah, well, it's uh, the team on the other side. They like to uh, <clears throat> generate a lot of offense under turnovers, and they're pretty explosive. And uh, I think we're the same way. And uh, once uh, two teams start doing that, you know. Uh, as you get the games like we did tonight, but uh, it was definitely a big win for us, and we're happy with what we did. What's it like to play in a living goal game? It doesn't happen too often to this team. Yeah, well, it's you know that's the type of team that the Flyers are. You know, uh, lots of firepower up front, and uh, I thought we did a great job scoring goals and uh, staying up and coming back in the game a couple times. Mark was saying the key was probably composure. Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, we stayed composed all game. We didn't panic when uh, they took uh, you know one goal lead or they actually did it twice. So, you know, it's uh, it's something that uh, you know that we need to build from and uh, learn from. And uh, you know, it was a fun game to be part of, but uh, I thought it was a really good good effort. Speaking of the composure, Patrice, after the first period, not one penalty. Um, how, how does that help in a game like this? It helps a lot. I mean, it's, you know, we obviously don't want to be. Uh, on the PK too much against them, you know, they're a great team and uh, their power play is unbelievable and, uh, you know, they have so many, uh, you know, they can score from on pretty much uh, the first three lines at least, even the four lines, so they're, uh, they're tough to play against and uh, I thought, uh, you know, playing five, five on five, we're a great team when we play five on five, so we had to do that. They almost feel like a street hockey game out there in the third period, just back and forth. Uh, I wouldn't say that, but it was, it was pretty open, you know, it was... Uh, um, we had chances on both sides, but uh, not, it's not typical of uh, our style of play, but I thought we did a good job. All right, we wrap it up. Two iron We were actually talking about that before the game yeah. in terms of the season. But I mean, was this sort of a, a microcosm of something like that? Well, exactly. I mean, you can't, you can't let your emotions, I mean, if, you know, there's going to be that through the game, and but if, you, if you stay with it and stay controlled, and, um, you know, it's going to pay off in the course of the year, too. You know, it makes you more of a consistent team if you can stay, you know, pretty even kill. And, you know, knowing to get the emotions up, knowing when you need to get your energy up, and, and you go out and do it. And, and um, you know, it's a, it was a big game for us today. I mean, it was, it was important. It was a good game for our confidence. And, uh, Guys, waiters here for people around you now. I know obviously you guys as leaders you want to pass those on to you. Can you help us? How nice is it to see a kid like Cam or so, you know, progress through a game like this? Well, it's great. Where, I mean, you know, they, I mean, you know, the guys believe in him, and, and uh, you know, he's a very confident kid when he plays, but I mean, in, in a sense, on the ice, and, um, he, he believes in his, in his abilities, which is great, and, and he's not afraid to jump. And, you know, we got to trust each other. And, and, you know, he trusted that, you know, somebody was going to be there for him, and we were going to work for it. And, you know, it's a great, uh, you know, it's a great sign for him. Kid. He controls the puck great, and he's a puck and, um, I'm not sure if the repair they did for him is going to be great. Really, it's Mr. Pro, so. You're a goalie, you were trying to do that, right? Yeah, I was trying to destroy it. I was just trying to get a good four check going.
nice lucky bounce. You take them. Don't get those too often. So. I'm sure you've been asked this before, but how uh, wide open were your eyes there on that goal? Oh, it was huge. I mean, it's just, you know, when you see a puck like that come out, you just hope it doesn't bounce over your stick or something when you have a wide open net. So. I know you're talking about everyone generally the offense uh, tonight. Camper, obviously, it's been a huge addition. And yeah. in general, 17 goals in the last three games yeah. is uh, certainly a major improvement. Oh, but what do you think is going differently? Well, we're, we're capable of doing it, so we know that. We're capable of being an offensive team. And, and um, you know, if we, if we play the right way, we'll score goals. And, you know, we, we're doing that now. And, you know, we're, we're, you know and, and the good thing about it is we still, you know, I don't think you've seen our best hockey yet. You know, we still, you know, we still got some, you know, we still can get better. We believe that. And, and uh, we're working at it. So.